Hi, this is Dan from the ECU Pro. Today I'm going to show you which components you need to send in to us and how we operate. First, you need to send in your DME, gas module, and a key. This is uh, one of the Mini Coopers out of our fleet. What we'll do is we'll take your DME, gas, and key, install it in one of our test cars, start the car, run the car, see what the problem is. If there's no problem, we charge you a small test fee, ship everything back so your mechanic can diagnose whatever else is wrong with your car. If there is a problem, we have the ability to fix the DME if it's fixable, or if, we, if it's bad and has to be replaced, we'll clone it to a working replacement. We can even, even sync these two up if need be. So what we do is we install it in the car, test it, um, do the repairs, then we go back and test it again and take video to show you that it runs, um, and then we email you the video. Remove the DME. First thing you do is take the key out of the ignition, make sure the car's off. Pop the hood. It'll be under this black cover. Just slide the cover off. Undo the three connectors and take a flathead screwdriver and on this end and this end, just start prying up gently the computer and it will slide out. Removal of the cast module. On the Mini Cooper, it's a little bit more um, complicated than BMW. What, where Mini Cooper put this cast module is actually under the dash cover. So what you have to do is take your time and remove the screws from the dash. It will lift up and the, and the cast module will be sitting basically right there. It'll be held on by one bolt. You take the bolt off, disconnect the two connectors, stick the cast module, one key, and the DME in a box and ship it to us.